Miss Jen here from Main and Substance Such I am B Simpton Fragrance Oil Supply. Oh, I am. Tell them if I have a normal bone or I have a crossbow. Yeah, he has a bow and arrow and a crossbow. Yeah. And Noah, tell them what you're wearing. And Noah and Barbara and I know what I'm wearing. And Barbara and I know what I'm wearing. Okay. Now that's good. Let me get to soaping, alright? Yeah, as long as you're not too loud, okay? So, um, what we are doing is I'm testing out a new blend um, that I'm going to make in soap. I'm actually mixing up my oatmeal and my clay and my goat milk that's down in the bottom. Kind of sticks down there. Okay. And um, what this is, it's going to be called Mocha Splash. And it's a blend of some coffee, some orange, and uh, some chocolate. So yum. And specifically, hey, Noah, shh. Thank you. Do not call. Thank you. And specifically for this video, I ordered and bought a chocolate mold because I wanted to um, put the little chocolate bars on top of my soap. So, that mold came in and I am ready. I made my blend and you know, I tested it out first on a cotton ball. And, um... Put it in a Ziploc bag. He wrote on the outside of the bag what it was. And then waited like half an hour to an hour. And went back and smelled it. And I was like, oh my goodness. This stuff is awesome. Now, where this is a blend, I'm not sure how it's going to perform. All on their own, each scent individually does fine. Um, but I'm not sure how they're all going to do together. And also, this soap will discolor very dark because of the chocolate and the coffee scent. So I'm going to pour out um, part of the top and leave unscented. That way I can do a fluffy topping. And I've actually forgot to get my cream, so I'm going to measure that out right now. for my soap. Give me just a moment. Okay. Alright, so let's pour my cream in. This is just heavy whipping cream that you need to buy from the store. Well, actually, this is the reconstituted kind. Um, I found a supplier that offers heavy cream in a powder form. Because what happens if I buy a big thing of heavy cream? Because, you know, the bigger size you buy, the better bang for your buck. I don't drink much coffee. Yeah, that's okay, Austin. I'm using my sauce. I don't drink much coffee, so if I buy a big thing of the cream and then I don't make soap for a couple of weeks, well, then my cream's gone to the bad. So I searched. I finally found somebody that offers it in um, a powder, and I just reconstitute it. Um, I do about 12 ounces at a time. Between 8 and 12 ounces. And with my lye. That has my silk. I'm actually going to get a little cup. For my white portion. It's stuck in the bale. Because I want to pour it out before I add the scent. Just in case um, 
Well, I mean, not just in case, because I know it's going to discolor. Is your gun broke? No. What does it stuck? The bullet was stuck. Yes. Oh, boy. Yes. I think that should be good. I don't want a whole lot. Hmm. There's a friend happy. There we go. Stuck in the barrel again. Did he get stuck in the barrel again? Yeah, yes. Yeah. Crazy bullet. Crazy bullet. That's what I'm using. So before I add the scent in there, I'm going to go ahead and do the white. Let me back you guys out some. I'm going to go ahead and do the white. Um. So. I don't transfer any scent in here. This is sort of like the cream on your coffee. Sorry, Mommy. Mm. You're okay. I saw it a well. behaving beautifully and it smells fantastic what are y'all shooting what are y'all shooting I hear you whispering what are you shooting you're playing the army oh man I'm just, I think I'm gonna stickle in this just a little bit more, mainly because um, it's, it's really slow and I need it to set up before my frosting does. Okay, hopefully that will be enough. To get it going. Well, you don't want that So the scent behaves beautifully.
I'm actually getting ready for a show I have in September. And this is one of the soaps I'll be taking with me. And if it does well, then um, if I have any left, I'll list them on my website for you guys. And if I don't, then I'll remake it. Because it smells really, really good. I like it better than my standard just coffee soap. back out of the way and as you can see here is my cute cute little um chocolate toppers let me rinse i'll be right back and pause you okay guys i actually stick blended this to get it coming along because it was really slow um what i'm going to do is use a little spoon uh, and kind of dollop it on the top. <clears throat> Can I see that okay? as I can get. Okay. Let's clean up my mold here. Now, I am probably going to turn this this way so I can see what I'm doing. Um... I don't want a whole lot of those things, of this sticking out. Can you get it? Yeah. Let's 
see. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Twelve. And thirteen. Okay. Just trying to make sure they're nice and straight. Now, I think also what I'm going to do is take a little bit of my coffee in my fingers, just kind of sprinkle it. Over time, the coffee can kind of bleed uh, across the top of the soap, kind of make like brown speckle, like, I'm not sure how to explain it. Um, like the color of the coffee can bleed across, but I don't mind. So there is my mocha uh, splash soap. I will bring you guys back for the cutting. Guys, I was in here for many sides and such. And what's what the something? Be something? Be something? Oh, and no longer stay. Bye guys, I'm still here. And, um, and. Oh, so just a little bit. Be scented. Be scented. Fragrant oil spray. This is the, um. Hold on, Noah, let me pause them. Uh, the milk of glass. And hi guys, um, this is. Do you see the chocolates? Do you see the chocolates, guys? Yes, I can see the chocolates. Did you put the little on this one? No, no blitter. It's got coffee grounds on top. Hold on, did I sweat it up, toffee? No, it's coffee grounds. I like the bottom of coffee. I'll show it to you. What is this for? And I must say that it what, smells what is this for? really good smell. Uh -huh. That's the tightener. Oh, that I blend is fantastic. It's so for harder soaps. Do you like this cutter? Yes, I love my cutter. Your daddy even made it. Hold on, was that when I have a tablet when I cut my ears on it? Look, I'm lanky. That one that I was using the saw in the house. I don't remember. I think it was. It was. You're right. Hold on. How did he make the wood that's supposed to move? Uh, mommy sanded it. Mommy helped, and mommy sanded it. And what? Hold this on. will turn really dark. Hold on, mommy. Hold on. You used the the saw in the kitchen to cut. Um. The tile for the bathroom? Yeah. Yeah. And I applied it to Daddy. Mommy used the wet saw. What? It was called a wet saw. So it would cut through hard things? Yeah, it uses water to cut. So you have to put water into it? Um, no. Well, yeah, you put water in the saw and then it, yes. um... It makes gas. Do you use it? No, it doesn't make gas. You turn it on and it has a little hose, listen to me, that runs the water up to the blade and keeps the blade cool so the blade does not overheat. And blow up. And it allows it to cut through like uh, tiles and... And wood. No, you don't use a wet saw for wood. You use like a skill saw or a miter saw, or something like that. Or, for, or a chainsaw. Or a chainsaw for wood. Uh, Hold on, will a wet saw cut through the door? Will a wet saw? Yeah. No, it's just like for the tile that we put down in the bathroom floor. Like the ceramic tile. So is, it, is the ceramic tile not that hard for it? 
Uh -huh. If you don't use the wet saw and keep it wet, it will get hot and it will bust the tiles and the, um, and it, the and blade will a blow break. Up. Mm -hmm. okay. hold, hold on, did, did I help you wind them too? Daddy? Yes, I would cut them and you would take the um, pieces to daddy. Hold on, hold on, were the little pieces for the sides? Yes, for around the toilet and... Um, Around the edges of the wall, and you know what? At the bathtub. Yeah. Hold on. Was well, it stayed right white in the middle of the room? White, white. I could not have placed those any more perfectly. But look, was it white? Was white? Was white hair? What? Look where I'm standing. Was white hair? Yes. The saw? That's where the saw was. Last bar. And I love it, guys. I oh. hope everybody else likes it, too. Mom, do you like the style of the bathroom now? Do yeah, you? it's much prettier. Um, just an update. I will have one listing. Um, this coming Friday will be my last listing until um, oh, I'm able to list, easy. list the witch soaps. And the uh, rainbow cupcakes um, and then after that I won't have any, another listing until the end of September um, gearing up for a show and that's what these soaps are for um, but any but soaps that I have left boy, over I'll be I'll use you, for my listing what Cut. no say thanks for watching thanks for watching bye bye